Hello everybody and welcome to Jumble House. It's Sunday and time for a new challenge. But before we go on to that, we want to show you what we did last week with our concentric circles. Do you remember we were looking for concentric circles in all kinds of things? And I tried really hard to make a mobile with concentric circles from a plastic plate. It was quite difficult, but in the end I managed and here it is. Yes, and I had to do quite a few different paintings on silk before I was successful. I found that working on wet silk just didn't work at all, it didn't make circles. So then I tried on the dry silk and look, they're not exactly circles but they are concentric. And my plasticine worked quite well too but it was quite hard to manipulate so I made lots of circles in different colours and then smoothed it all down and made this little pot. It's a bit like one of those Chinese ones isn't it? Yes, and I cut lots of shaped circles out of coloured paper and put them together and I made this picture. We all had lots of fun with the circles, but now it's time for this week's challenge, which is all about spirals. Look, this picture is taken from the bottom of the pagoda, looking right up to the top. You can see the spiral staircase going right up. You'll find lots of spirals in buildings, but even more in animals and plants. Look, here's the clue. So this week's challenge is to see how many spirals you can find in buildings and animals and plants and see if you can make something using spirals or maybe paint a picture, maybe you can make a soft toy with spirals in like the snail. So goodbye for now from me Georgie and Jumble House. I hope you have fun. See you next time.